Hey Hair Foods fam! Remember we talked about uh, hair care, my favorite subject, and we're highlighting uh, Quench. So you get all of the wonderful benefits of Quench Ultra Rich, Ultra Rich Conditioner, right? The thick stuff that can be used for a mask, deep conditioning, co-washing even. Jocelyn is a wash and go girl, and she loves her big, curly, frizzy, wonderful, voluminous, kinky, curly texture, but she also loves to straighten it occasionally. And healthy hair affords you versatile hair. Versatile styling makes a girl happier. You've always heard me say wash and go styling simply allows you to incorporate your entire hair and styling routine into your shower routine. So, ja, Jalsa does. You like wash and go styling every day, right? Um, pretty much, yeah. Okay, so pretty much. But if she doesn't, and she is slipping, uh, Jocelyn can sleep overnight or have a uh, cap uh, with do a deep conditioning treatment with a plastic cap. Um, why it's important to deep condition your hair um, before heat styling um, and why you can just uh, omit all of that if you're doing a lot of wash and go styling um, is that it, your hair, it gives your hair its ability to have, be its own heat protected. So we're going to show you how one deep conditioning can give Jalsa um, beautiful shiny hair when she does her blow dry. So Jalsa and I are here at the Shampoo Bowl to show you exactly the misstep that a lot of women make when they are doing conditioning. One, um, clearly she got a lot of hair and y'all be playing games with conditioner. Um, you need as much conditioner on your hair as you have hair on your head. So a little bit of conditioner on a lot of hair is not going to ever do anything. What's great about Quench Ultra Rich Conditioner is that it's super thick and it's concentrated. So the more water you add to it, the more it moves through the hair and emulsifies. The more moisturized and enriched and softened your naturally dry texture is, the easier it is to blow dry and the less heat and the excessive heat thing is becomes a non-factor because now you're blow drying hair that's super soft through what? Deep conditioning. Or at least being mindful of your texture um, like in taking care of it like you would your favorite cashmere sweater. You, you've always heard me say that it's really about looking at your hair like a fine fabric and understanding how to take care of it. I blew out Jocelyn's hair with uh, blow it all out. Hair will blow it all out. Pre dried it so it's super soft from her quench deep conditioner that we sat in the dryer. Um, as well as Jocelyn's uh, normal hair routine, which is a lot of washing and styling. So her hair is primed and soft and moisturized enough to give it a heat style. And we probably blow it out maybe once a month or so. Here's the thing with heat styling. Heat does not damage hair, people damage hair. It's not necessary for any hair texture unless it's been dried out, terribly dried out, which is why I would not suggest going over any hair texture to both straighten and curl um, more than once. 